So I put Nate on Craigslist today, just trying to find somebody around here to ride with. You know, someone kind of close to me. Yeah, I got like 140 emails back within about three hours. And it was all, come check out my website at blah, blah, blah. For hot nude pictures, email me at blah, blah, blah. Like, geez, you can't put any kind of ad on Craigslist anymore without getting 100 spam an hour. Just about got all the fields harvested around this area. It's gone quick. It seems like just in two weeks, you know, it's gone from full fields to there's hardly any left that have anything in them. They sure are quick getting them out. I have noticed is we're sure getting some pretty sunrises and sunsets here lately. You know, in the fall, I think you get the best sunsets. You get the harvest moon and, uh, you know, the big huge ass moon that looks like it's like sitting on the earth. That's pretty dang cool. Reminds me of a story once. I was just out of high school by about two years. And there was a girl I knew, and she still went to high school. I think she was a junior. And another girl I knew, was it was her senior year, and she asked me to go to the Harvest Moon dance with her. So I did. And, uh, you know, we got to the school, and that other girl was there. I started dancing with the other girl. Of course, my date didn't really care for that too much. And the other girl's date, he didn't care for that very much either. She had this big bow on the back of her dress. And, you know, it was positioned just enough to cover where I could put my hands somewhere where a boyfriend would not like another guy to have his hands on his girlfriend. So it was it was a good time. By the time we finally realized that we was the only ones out there, they're playing Metallica and we're the only ones slow dancing out there. I got a hold of her ass and yeah, it was we just held hands, walked back to the table, I dropped her off, I went back to my date and I started dancing with her again and it didn't matter, you know. We all went and got some liquor afterwards and had a good time, so it's all good. I still have no clue where I'm going. I would just about put money on Starbucks this evening, though. I went last night. Uh, I put a post Instagram on it. I tried their, um, oh, what the hell is it? It's a pecan pumpkin something latte. But it's, got, it's supposed to have, it don't even have little bits of pecan in it. I'm like, what the hell? You know, the picture looks like it has little chunks of pecan. There's no pecan in it. It's pecan flavor. I saw something on Facebook the other day. It said, uh, pumpkin spice is the new bacon. Okay, that's just pure bullshit. Pumpkin spice. Nothing will ever take the place of bacon. 